Hey guys, what's up, Taurus? Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. We're going to do a reading for your immediate future. Um, we're going to take a look at the situation that you'll face, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Um, keep in mind the energy can go both ways. So this could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with. Also, um, this is a general reading, so it may not resonate for everyone, but if it does, make sure you hit the subscribe button, please. Taurus. I also post to you guys this um, month ahead for September and your year ahead from September to next August, so make sure you check that out too, um, especially if you've had some negative behavior patterns in the past. Um, as far as relationships go, because it looks like those could possibly be coming back to haunt you. All right. Taurus. Let's do this. Taurus. Media future for Taurus, please. Media future for Taurus. Situation of for outcomes of Taurus. Alright. Three of Wands. You guys are waiting for something or for someone. For some of you guys, this could be visitors. Something like that. Taurus, please. Immediate future for Taurus. Alright, yeah. Well, if you have been waiting for something to change, it possibly could be with the world card there. Alright, we have two cards for the outcome. Yeah, if you've been waiting for something and things have kind of just been like, where are my ships? Why aren't they coming in? Um, I think they're here bottom of the deck the sign i'm not sure you see it yet but um because i think you've just been waiting waiting for something someone i'm not sure yep told you tower some type of tower moment i'm not sure if this has happened for you yet but if not it's about to happen what is this tower for taurus please thank you oh Ace of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. So if you've been waiting for like a love situation or maybe somebody at a distance, yeah, I'm taking all of these because there's definitely communication. Something changed. It could be with someone at a distance. It could be the distance between you with the world card. They, you know, maybe you just couldn't get to them lately because of Corona. But that that's changing. The Three of Pentacles. That's somebody wanting to work together to start planning for the future. You have the Ace of Cups, the Six of Cups. So. This could be someone from your past. I don't know. But there's definitely communication. If not, this is definitely a soulmate, though. So that's what's up. If you've been waiting for your ships to come in, it's here. Yeah, this communication. Page of Wands. It's going to make you feel good. Show me this world as the obstacle. This is one cycle ending and another beginning and you definitely have a tower moment for the Ace of Cups. Like, you know, sometimes tower moments can be negative. Um, yeah, this could be an ex. This could just be something very, very passionate. It could be with a Capricorn. But anyways, like I was saying, your tower moment is new love. And um, you already have the Ace of Cups and the Two of Cups. That's, you know, spending quality time, seeing eye to eye. Um, at least conversations if it's not in person. Tell me about this devil. Why is the devil here for Taurus? Yeah. Damn, what the will of fortune. I feel like this is like more passion. I don't feel like this is with the judgment. I feel like this is just going to make you happy. I don't. This is ending one cycle and a new one beginning. With the will of fortune, you have. It's like you have the angels on your side. Even though the devil is here, I'm kind of feeling more like this is like a lot of passion behind this. The Empress, there it is. I'm kind of feeling like um, you're just, you're feeling good. You have one, two, three, five major arcanas here. There is no, it just in this section, because you have the tower over here, you have the will of fortune, judgment, the empress, the world. That's a lot. This will change things for you. I'm feeling like in a great way. You may be moving forward with this cycle, ending this cycle with the X, because I don't feel like this is like um bad at all. Like this gives me like the happy energy like you know 
and you get nervous or like you see somebody that you like and you just kind of know it I think this is gonna make you happy I think you're ending the cycle with some toxic shit and move or you know toxic behaviors in the past and you're moving forward towards you know you're getting your good karma here is what it feels like wow that's great show me this knight of swords so for the outcome we have the knight of swords um and the two of cups so use your intuition but that is unexpected truth yeah this, for some of you guys this could be an ex you know somebody third party situation in the past but this is more somebody's communicating they're speaking their truth there could be a reconciliation show me this two of cups so if this is somebody from your past, um, you know, that you've dealt with before and had some infidelity here, um, use your intuition because it may still be here. But they may be trying to come and speak their truth here. Definitely a, um, a reconciliation. Somebody has definitely really been stressing over you here. And possibly, like, you've been holding back from them. So, I don't know. For some of you, you're just not going to trust this. For others of you, there's a reason not to trust it. 